We've been following the case of Maggie and Paul Murdoch, found dead at their family home in Colleton County. The person usually responsible for prosecuting these cases in the Low Country has stepped aside, citing conflicts. Tonight, Duffy Stone talks only to WSAV's Andrew Davis about this controversial decision. And Andrew's joining us now live from our Low Country newsroom. Well, the case has made national news. Maggie and Paul Murdoch, a mother and son gunned down in Colleton County, still no suspects arrested. 14th Circuit Solicitor Duffy Stone officially recused himself from the case just last week. He used to work under former solicitor Randolph Murdoch and with Alec Murdoch, Maggie's husband in the past. Now, Stone says those relationships, though, had nothing to do with his decision. It is a decision based in legal ethics. My relationship with them uh, as victims of this crime, uh, as potential witnesses of this crime, does not conflict me out of this case and does not put me in a position of having to step aside. Stone says he only decided to step aside from the case after consulting with University of South Carolina legal ethics professor and expert Dr. Greg Adams. I knew that there was a, an ethical issue and I needed advice on it. I got that advice and I followed the advice and um, that's what prosecutors are supposed to do. Uh, you don't just get out of a case because it's uncomfortable or because people are saying you should. There was something that changed before you sent that letter to that's the Attorney correct. General's office. That's correct. It's something you can't talk about. And I cannot tell you what it is. It would not be proper for me to tell you what it is because Easy. then I would be violating the exact same ethics that I have followed since the very beginning of this case. So if I asked you, does it have anything to do with the suspect in the case? I wouldn't tell you. If I asked, it had to do information in, in uh, evidence that was found in the case? I wouldn't tell you that either. How complicated is this case? The event happened, what, two months ago? Nobody's been arrested? That should answer your question. I think you sign up for this job recognizing that you're not always going to make the popular decision. And I'm going to make the decision that I think is right, and I'm going to stick with that, and I'm comfortable with those decisions. Now, I asked Stone why he recused himself immediately from Paul Murdoch's case involving the death of Mallory Beach. He said there were no similarities in the two cases. And as for the 2015 death of Stephen Smith, a case that SLED has now reopened as they gathered evidence in the Murdoch case, Stone says that has no connection. He has no connection to the investigation, was not involved the first time, and has not been contacted again. Andrew Davis, WSAV News 3, on your side. Andrew, thank you.